One of the really neat things about Robert E. Knox Scout Reservation is the fact that we're a 535 acre camp on a 72,000 acre lake, the largest man-made lake east of the Mississippi River. That provides aquatic opportunities for us that most camps would only dream of. Uh, normally a, a Boy Scout camp will have a 30, 40 acre lake that they can do some boat, small boat sailing or something on. We've got a lake that literally extends for miles. We have the opportunity when we do the jet ski program, not just to run around in circles, but to run up and down the lake for 45 minutes at a shot. Well, when you look at the core values of scouting, on my honor, I will do my best to do my duty to God and my country. Scouting believes in patriotism. Scouting believes in what's made America great. That is the very fabric of scouting. So we think that that's a critical component of what we do, is to teach that proper respect, to reinforce those values as a young man continues to grow and develop. A lot of the kids like the, like the view, of course, from the amphitheater, the way everything looks, the way the camp works, the food, the classes, the program, the activities, everything. Aquatics this year, we're doing a new program. We've got a jet ski program for some of our older boys. We also offer the blog for during free time for all the kids. That's a big favorite for all the campers, and they all love to do that. We do a bunch of other programs too, like the standard Boy Scout badges, like kayaking, canoeing, stuff like that. Well, you know, the really cool thing about the Iron Scout is that not only does it work through a scout is physically fit, it's a fun challenge. And because Augusta is home to the half Iron Man, we took a play on the Iron Man Triathlon to create the Iron Scout. Our scouts will run for one mile, they'll get on a bicycle, transition to the bike, bicycle for seven miles over to our other camp, Camp Daniel Marshall, at which point they'll transition back to a kayak and kayak back to Robert E. Knox Scout Reservation, which is another mile kayak event, and that thus completing the Knox Iron Scout. Some merit badges are very in-depth and take a lot of time. Others are a little easier. Some are fun, some are career oriented, some are nature and outdoor oriented. We actually offer over 55 merit badges at Robert E. Knox Scout Reservation that scouts have the ability to take part in. Some of our STEM related merit badges such as welding and search and rescue, uh, some of those types of things are, are certainly a, uh, a component of what we do. We also offer twilight merit badges, so in the evening when it's not quite so hot that we can do that, it is, and fun merit badges. Again, some of the traditional merit badges that you always think of with the Boy Scout camp, pioneering, cooking, camping, hiking merit badge, but we also do some unusual things, water sports, scuba diving, uh, you know, rocketry, some of those types of things as well. So there's, there's a great variety and we have a little something for everyone when they come to camp. The, the neat thing about having scouts from other Boy Scout councils, it gives youth an opportunity to meet and mingle with kids that they would never otherwise meet. The brotherhood of scouting, the fellowship that it creates is just a once in a lifetime experience. And a lot of these guys will take that, that, that experience away with them after their week of camp and it will be a lifetime memory. This is the second year we've offered golf merit badge. Uh, because of proximity of Rocky Branch Golf Course, only being about four miles from camp, they, uh, the folks who uh, run the course were very kind to us. They were able to work with us. And we teach most of the golf merit badge at camp during the week. And then they come to play golf on the course to complete the requirements for the merit badge at the end of the week. When you go to Boy Scout camp, it's an experience. It's designed to take you out of your comfort zone. It's to disconnect you from the Nintendo and the Xbox. It's an opportunity for you to do things that you may not otherwise do. And some of it may not always be the most enjoyable at the time, but much like all of your friends that you hear that walked to school both ways uphill in the snow when they were a kid, 
these things, these trials, these tribulations that they think they're going through now will become a badge of honor for them later in life. And it's, it's really a neat opportunity. I've had so many parents over my career in scouting tell me how much their son has grown in just that one week that he's gone to camp, that they can physically see it in, in the way they behave, the way they carry themselves, the things that they do. And that, that truly is what scouting is all about, is to helping young people to prepare, to prepare them to achieve their, their potential in life. It's amazing the number of gentlemen that I've run into in their 50s, 60s, 70s, and even 80s that say, oh, I remember when I went to camp as a scout. Whether it's at Robert E. Knox or any other camp, those memories stay with them forever. And that's really the neat thing. Knox is a great camp, and we'd love to have anybody and everybody who wants to come out here. And we promise you that you'll have a great time if you do. that the closing campfire gives you an opportunity not only for recognition for what you've done for the week, but to cement those memories forever. Of the National Eagle Scout Association Outstanding Eagle Scout Award on Dr. Cutting. Congratulations and thank you very much.